the woman who was in the home destroyed by Anne Haitian last week's fatal car accident has broken her silence on the destruction of the property and all her belongings. Lynn Nishel rented the property that went up in flames on Friday last week after Hollywood star Anne drove into it, infighting a fire that destroyed the property and all items within it. A donation website has been set up in support of Lynn to help her recover from the destruction of the property that was in the Mar Vista neighborhood of Los Angeles. Footage shared online showed Lynn addressing the destruction of her home, and showed her offering sympathy following Anne's tragic passing a week after the incident. In a video message shared via Instagram, Lynn said, The news of Anne Heche passing is devastating. Her family and her friends and her children especially really have suffered a great loss and my heart goes out for them. She continued, this entire situation is tragic and there really are just no words. I am sending love to everyone involved. Lynn's message was released in response to a GoFundMe page being created to help raise money for her following the destruction of her home. So far the appeal has raised over 160,000 US dollars, 136,000 pounds to help Lynn replace her possessions which were all destroyed in the incident. She said, I did want to send a huge, huge thank you to everybody from all over the world for the overwhelming amount of love and compassion and generosity and kindness that people have shown over the past week. She continued, it's obviously been the most insane, dramatic time, confusing, so eventually I will try to get back to everybody and read everybody's comments, but thank you, thank you from the bottom of my heart. She added, it's really truly overwhelming. You guys have really impacted my life in a very profound way, so thank you so much to everybody and I will keep you updated. The appeal was set up by landlords Jenny and John Durand, who describe Lynn as a kind and generous person who is always first to offer help to others. They wrote on the GoFundMe page, Today we are asking the community to come together and help Lynn start over. Please, please join us minus 100% of the proceeds from this fundraiser are going directly to Lynn Miss Hell. On Friday, Anne's death was announced with the actress succumbing to her injuries a week after he accident and at the age of 53. She left behind two sons, age 20 and 13, from past relationships with exes Coleman Coley LaFoon and James Tupper respectively. Do you have a story to sell? Get in touch with us at Web Celebs at Mirror. UK or call us direct at 0207 293 3033.